penultimate game of the USL Championship regular season. And playoff positioning on the line. Elvis Osmanovic blows the whistle and we are underway from Protective Stadium between Birmingham and Monterey Bay. Gleedle. To donor, his serve got all the way through and it's just over the top there from Dixon. Pasher with two arms up. Serves a driven ball. Nwegbo tried to flick it at the front post. He says it was deflected. Referee didn't agree. It's been the goalkeeper late and a giveaway there by Roof at the back. Here comes Monterey Bay. O'Coley got it out wide. Gleedle chopped down by Martinez. Free kick given this surely is yellow. And it is our first yellow card of the day brought to you by Rubio Law Firm. And Tyler Pasher coming forward. Behind for Preston Itaka with the flag up at the very last and then a collision between Itaka and Herrera, the goalkeeper. And Preston Tabord Itaka is gonna be shown a yellow card. First, it looks like he's on sides at the moment the ball is played. Right here as he tries to slow up, the goalkeeper does nothing to move out of the way at all. Birmingham working in their attacking half a bit more over the last five or six minutes. There has been a shift. Kasim to the byline, his serve redirected off the bar. Preston Itaka got a piece of it. Attacking play, the ball goes wide. A perfect ball played into Preston Tabor Itaka. And unfortunately for him, his touch goes off of the post and out. It looks like maybe a great sliding tackle. To Herrera sends it away. And a huge collision and a foul. Free kick given. O'Coley coming in hard. And the bulk of the chances. Monterey Bay playing with a lot of confidence early. They've played well against Eastern Conference opponents this year. 5 4. The Birmingham attack. Prosper Kasim with space. Working with Preston Itaka. Holds it up. He has Pasher to his right. Back to the feet of Kasim. He's got some space. He lets it go. Herrera plays it on a bounce. All important match here, Protective Stadium. And a late whistle and a foul. Juan Agadello, a late challenge on Maury Donor. Both players down and appear to be injured. And a yellow card out. That's going to be shown to Agadello. Yeah, that home match against San Diego really springs to mind. Monterey Bay led that one late 2 1. And two very late goals from San Diego. That was thievery of the highest order from San Diego to walk away from that match with three points. They played San Diego again, winning 1-0 and gave up four goals. Kasim couldn't get around Kai Green. Monterey Bay trying to counter quickly. Alex Dixon on the run. That pass is going to get to him. Cronali with defending to do. Dixon dribbling at him. Gleedle couldn't let it go. Mensa got a touch to it. And Cronali pushed in the back. Free kick given. And Christina Chambers down below 15 minutes in. So far, so good for Monterey Bay. What was the message from Frank Yallop at the break? Yeah, he was really happy with the way his team started in the first half. He said the last 10 minutes they weren't as crisp, but he says, hey, we got to be better on the break. They're missing that final touch on the attack. He said defensively, though, they're defending well, and they just got to keep doing it. Agatello got on the end of it. It bounced off the bar not once, but twice. Did it go over the line? Yes, it did. Juan Agatello puts Birmingham in front. And this is a big time goal, big time in importance, but just a magical first touch from Juan Agatello. Involved, great ball served in, a little flick behind his own back, then the outside of the right boot. Magical touch and a great finish. Carlos Herrera doing everything he can to try and keep it out. But that ball clearly across the line before he swats at it. Again, the last shot for Monterey Bay came in the 25th minute. They still haven't had a shot on target today. That could change here. Flag stays down. Gleedle is in, and he pulls it wide. Oh, goodness me. Here's the great pass that puts Gleedle through, does everything right. Space Birmingham pushing forward with the bandit. Steven Wakebo almost got there. Excellent defending. It had to be inch perfect for Yoseki. 
And Kasim, with outstretched arms, slowed down Maury Doner. He'll take the yellow card brought to you by Rubio Lawfer. The brightest young players in the USL Championship this year, just back from youth national team camp. Preston Itaka, another dangerous ball. Nico Brett off the post. Demon Wagbo couldn't quite put it back on frame. Preston Itaka against Roberts to the byline. Another serve. Brett Birmingham have now been denied by both posts today. Perfect service. Nico Brett heads it down into the turf. Against Joseki, Nwagbo cuts it inside. Nwagbo trying to keep it, a big collision. Free allows play to continue. Good tackle from Enzo Martinez. Alex Cronali to ground to take it away from Chase Boone. Possession. But Monterey Bay doing a really good job of pressing them and forcing them into a little bit speedier play. Kasim, Colin Smith into the area. Smith. Against Galito, gets to the byline. Smith scores! How about that from Colin Smith? He doubles the Birmingham lead. Want to play safe and keep their outside backs. Instead, Colin Smith says, I'm going forward and I'm going to goal. And he just hammers this ball into the far side netting. Some oohs and ahs for the crowd down below. That was. Good touch from Smith. Kasim does well in a tight space, too. I can tell about wide Gabriel Alves. Does he serve it in? Agadello, top of the box. Corcoran leaves it for Martinez. Corcoran will serve, and it's just a bit wide. Right on Prosper Kasim's head. But he couldn't redirect it on frame, and he gets up with a smile. He was in a great position. It was a great ball. It just came with so much pace. He could not. The Legion will get all three points in their final contest of the year here at Protective Stadium. Nico Brett is on side. Behind the Monterey Bay defense, does he try for a third? His shot whistles wide. Well, he was going to go for goal with just seconds left. There was nothing to lose. He's a natural attacking player. He's not going to think about possession at that point. And that is full time. Birmingham Legion for the fifth straight year are back in the USL Championship playoffs with a 2-0 win here at home against Monterey Bay.